I think trying to sell himself, you know, as, as an agent of change was a mistake. I just simply, I don't think it was a matter of strategy or tactics. I think he was simply the wrong man for the time. Uh, I don't know. I think that the, the hand was stacked, stacked against him. You know, the media was stacked against him. Uh, not have chosen Sarah Palin, probably chosen someone like Mitt Romney or someone with more economic, you know, experience. Don't know. We'll see how Obama does. And um, I think, you know, the country as a whole is still a little to the right. And I think, uh, you know, down the road, things will bode well. Well, they can either reinvent themselves or become a permanent minority party. I think they'll be reworking their party a lot. Um, but going back to maybe more traditional Republican stances, like actual conservatism with money. I think the Republicans need to regroup. And I think they will. And I think the better minds in the party will, will, will rethink this. And I think that they will perhaps understand that this is an age where governing with, in, in an inclusive way is the most effective way to govern. I think um, President-elect Obama should bring in the best people he thinks uh, can do the job, be they Democrats, Republicans, independents, what have you. On the defense side, maybe. Uh, I don't think it, it is necessary if he uh, can find enough uh, good people from his own party to work with. I think it depends on where they've stood on the issues for the um, times that they've been in office. Um, if they've sided with George Bush, we really don't want anybody in office that has done more of the same. Yes, it should bring everybody into the table. Because he promised uh, to bring us all together, so he should deliver on that.